Hi and welcome to this tutorial. In this video, we're going to have a look at how to display a gallery with the help of the dynamic repeater widget in Jet Engine plugin for Elementor. So first from the dashboard, we'll need to go and create a meta box where we're going to place the repeater meta field. You can either create a meta box and apply it to the existing post type, or you can create a new custom post type and then add the meta boxes right there while creating the post type. But here I'm going to go ahead and add a meta box. So you apply this meta box for the post and I'm going to choose the default post type called post. And here in the meta field box, I'm going to create a new meta field. And here in the type, I'll choose the repeater. And this will be a repeater. And in the repeater fields, I'll add one gallery field. And in the type, I'll choose gallery. And here we'll click add meta box. Now I'll go to post and choose one post that I want to add it and add there my gallery. So I click add it and I'll scroll down and find the meta box that I have just created. So here it goes and I click choose media. So I've added three images and I'll click update so the changes are saved. And now I can either add the dynamic repeater widget to this page, to this specific post, or you can go ahead and create a listing but for example purposes, I'm going to add this dynamic repeater to the same page of this post. So here in the Elementor editor, we'll need to add the dynamic repeater widget to our page. And in the source drop down, select that meta field that you have created with the repeater in the gallery. And one single thing that you need to do is to insert the macros in here in the item format field. To get those macros, go to Jet Engine documentation, go to the contents, and in the Jet Engine widgets, find the dynamic repeater. And in this section, scroll down and find the displaying images, posts, and galleries with repeater. And here you're gonna have galleries, and this is the macros that you're gonna need to copy. So I'll copy that and I go back to Elementor. And I'll insert it here so as you see this gallery one this is just a sample and you're gonna need to replace it with your own id of that specific of that specific item in the repeater that contains your gallery and here it goes once you insert that macros and you add the id of your gallery item in the repeater meta field you're gonna see your gallery right there in that section where you've added the dynamic repeater then you can go ahead and go through the style settings for this section. And for the creating the gallery with the dynamic repeater widget, it was pretty much it. Now you know how to do that with the help of Jet Engine plugin for Elementor. I hope this tutorial was useful. Thank you for watching.